Good morning from the National Weather Service office in Gaylord. Welcome to the latest hazardous weather briefing for Eastern Upper in Northern Lower Michigan. Today is Thursday, March 6, 2014. We do have some warmer temperatures which will be working their way back into the Great Lakes region over the next 48 hours ahead of a cold front that will be coming through the Upper Great Lakes later Friday into Friday night. As that warmer air does arrive, however, it will increase the threat for precipitation ahead of this cold front, and there is a threat we could see some freezing drizzle develop mainly across eastern upper Michigan and the Straits region later on tonight and into early Friday morning, which will uh, possibly create some slick roadways across uh, those portions of the forecast area. Here's a look at the current weather map. We have high pressure over uh, Quebec with a large area of uh, uh, clockwise winds around that uh, area of high pressure. Uh, currently bringing easterly winds to northern Michigan, but eventually those winds will shift around to the southeast and south later today and begin the process of bringing some warmer air up into the Great Lakes region. There is a disorganized area of low pressure over Montana this morning, and that will become a little better organized uh, later on this afternoon and tonight uh, as it moves across the upper Midwest and eventually will drag a cold front across Michigan later on Friday. Uh, today's weather map uh, looks fairly quiet um, for the most part with the area of high pressure uh, still in control of Michigan's weather. Uh, eventually we'll see some, the threat, as I mentioned earlier, of some uh, patchy freezing drizzle uh, later on tonight. And that will change over to some light snow by Friday morning. And there is the threat for some light snow or mixed rain and snow across uh, much of the region uh, during the day on Friday ahead of a cold front, uh, which will be coming to the region later Friday night and into uh, the first part of Saturday. That concludes this hazardous weather briefing for this morning. Thank you for listening. And the next update is expected around 5 a.m. Friday morning.